it's Carly Batucci and Jesse. Jesse's here. Surprise. Hi. We didn't plan to go live today, but we're very excited about the new paper pumpkin. It looks so good. Oh my goodness, so good and so cheap. Jesse was sh shocked. Was she was like, like hundred bucks. Thirty-seven. Yeah. Thirty-seven. Bargain. It does not come with a block, though. You I've need got, a block. We got stacks of blocks. But everyone has blocks. Yeah. And if you don't, just use the back of your mobile phone. <laughs> Whoa, that's a good idea. <laughs> I know, it's true. We've done that before. We've all done that before. What happened then? I just want my nose and want this. <laughs> no, I'll just do it off here so I'm not I'll so just crap. be discreet. <laughs> <laughs> so we decided... Excuse me. What did you just say about Jessie? I called myself an idiot. You're not allowed to do that about my friend Jessie. <laughs> Jessie's not an idiot. Okay, Don't say that back. about Jessie. Awesome. Thank you. That's much better. So have we gone live in the right spot? Is everyone commenting? Look at Jessie. She's like, I don't know. Has it gone live? On, when I see it at home, there's like a little thing that says how many people are Here watching. it is. Oh, Hi. Hi. Hi Jessica, hi Vicky, Ben. So we decided to have a bit of fun today. And we, researched, we researched all the colours that are in the paper pumpkin kit. The, the hugs from Shelly. We all want a hug from Shelly. I want a hug from Shelly. So if you don't know who Shelly is, if you're new to Stamping Up and you don't know who Shelly is, you need to know because she is the co-founder of Stamping Up and basically we can thank her for continuing with stamping up that's the whole reason why it's still here but this kit is so beautiful and it has everything you need other than the block and you'll be able to make 12 cards I'm pretty sure let's check to make sure yes 12 cards three cards of four unique designs so four different designs and the one that they sneak peeked is yes, beautiful it it's is my beautiful. favorite yeah even though beautiful. i haven't seen the other <laughs> Just ones like, i don't need to see the rest that one's my favorite the one on the video yeah so we are very excited about this kit because it has never Ooh, officially lucky been Donna. here got a hug from shelly oh she got a real hug from shelly yeah, we're very excited because this is the first time Paper Pumpkin has been in the South Pacific. It has been in the US for a long time. And in the US, it's a subscription. Whereas we get to have it as just a one-off kit that you can purchase. You don't have to subscribe here in the South Pacific. So we are very, very excited about this kit. So buy two. Well, there are a lot buy of people two. that are buying two. Brené bought one, but I'm thinking we need to get a few spares because it's kind of like a collector's item, mm. the fact that we have it here. And we will be doing a class together on the 31st of May here in Australia. So for some of you, that's the 30th if you're not in Australia. And we're going to be doing the whole kit together. So if you want to keep one kit and then do the kit <laughs> with me, then you can do that. Um, but I'm very excited. And I know from the way that it has the response already – how many did I say we've sold already? Probably about 10 or 10. so already. I know. It's so exciting. So we're very excited. Now, basically what I've done, we looked at the colors and the colors that we found were early espresso, old olive. This is what they said is in the kit. Uh, we've got petal pink. We've got the beautiful new pretty peacock that is in there as well. And even pool party. Which was a bit of a surprise. We are like, pool party as well. Mm. So we don't know exactly what the cards are going to look like. But we thought, you know what? We don't have the kit. But let's play with the colours. Let's like do a little bit of our own little mashup. And the thing that Shelley said she wanted was birds. Yeah. Did you like her Mary Poppins thing? That was so cute. In fact, let's have a quick look at it. Because can it's you do so... That? Yeah, I can do that. I can show it. Let's have a look at this video because it is so cute and adorable. You're going to want to see it for yourself. And if you've already seen it, that's okay. You can see it again. Go make yourself a cuppa. Go make yourself a cuppa. <laughs> because it's really, really cute what Shelly did. She was like fully Mary Poppins. Mm -hmm. And it's so cute. So let's open this up. And we've got to do full screen because... Jessie can't handle anything that's not full screen. Isn't that right, Jessie? Yep. And we need... Oh, we need this camera. Look at me. I'm like, why isn't it displaying it? It's because I didn't click the camera. Because it'll go boom. 
and Shelly will appear. I'm so excited. Are you? Yeah. Oh, you're ready. This is the magic. This is the amazing um, art of magic camera. Oh, where there's Shelly. Oh, someone else has just ordered something. They all can see that. <laughs> 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 Order notifications. Yay. <laughs> So let's play this. I'll make sure the volume's up because I turned it down before so you didn't hear my... Okay, here's Shelly. Three minutes, 22. Hi, I'm Shelly with Stampin' Up! And I'm always excited to unbox my paper pumpkin kit every single month. But this one is especially fun for me. Remember a couple of years ago when Sarah worked with the paper pumpkin team to help inspire and create her very own Sarah kit? Well, now it's my turn, and I'm here to introduce the Shelly Kit. I worked closely with the kit's concept artist and designer to bring my own personal style and taste into this kit, which I love, by the way. I would describe it as a touch of earthy and elegant spring with lots of layers and texture. Now, I've worked a little magic inside of my specially designed box so that I can show so you a little bit more behind the inspiration Adorbs. from the Hugs from Shelly kit. Oh, that just so, for the box. let's have a look. Some of my favorite Stampin' Up! Mm. colors are in the kit. We've included Pool Party, Early Espresso. Oh, we miss Soft Suede. Soft, soft suede. suede. One of my very favorites, Petal Pink, Pink. And a brand new in color that you may not have seen yet featured in the new 2019-2020 annual catalog and it's called Pretty Peacock. My new favorite. Such a Hello Pretty look. Peacock. <laughs> now I'm really excited about this kit's design because it incorporates a couple of nature elements that I personally love like birds. Ooh. Especially birds. This is my favorite nests. part. Ooh. So cute. And of course Flowers. Oh, how did she get that out of the box? <laughs> now my last magic kit shows you how all of this inspiration results in a truly beautiful card. Ooh, you love it? That's my favorite. <laughs> this is just one of four cards you can make yourself once you get the Shelly kit. And the envelopes are pre-printed, and we've even got so pretty. As you can see, I'm pretty excited about this kit. So excited, in fact, that we decided to share it with everyone, not just our subscribers in North America. If you are in Yay! North America, you can get the Shelly kit by subscribing as you normally would during the May subscription period, which lasts until May 10th. Now for our global markets, talk to your demonstrator. That's me. Or look for the kit <laughs> at stampinup.com starting May 15th while supplies last. As I said earlier, I always love opening my paper pumpkin kit every month. It's such a fun surprise to see a brand new project ready to make and give to someone I care about. I hope you feel the same and that you're extra excited to share the Hugs from Shelly kit with me. Happy stamping! Thanks Shelly! Bye Shelly! Hugs from Shelly! So, we are very excited. Can you see why we're excited now? Because mm -hmm. it's like, oh, this is going to be so much fun. So you saw the beautiful sample. That's Jessie's favorite card that we yep. saw. She doesn't need to see any of the others. I'm done. Just 12, <laughs> 12 of those, please. Hi, Luke. We're back. He said, I'm confused. That's not Kylie. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was the co-founder of Stamping Up that was talking. She just took over our broadcast. Mm -hmm. She had a special message to share. Do you want to buy some paper Mary pumpkin? Poppins. Yeah, Luke, you got to get some paper pumpkin. So what we decided today to do, and it's been a lot of fun for me. Now, I have some that I'm keeping as a surprise. You have to come over to the blog to see the other two samples that I've made. But I've made my own... Hugs with Shelly samples. Ooh. Because I love the colors and I wanted to see what I could come up with using a brand new stamp set that is coming in the new annual catalog. This one here, Free as a Bird, because Shelly pulled out the, the nest and the birds from her 
kit. So I thought this is a perfect one. And I noticed that on the little envelope and on the card was the shapes from the nested framelit dies. So I thought, well, that coordinates really well because that was the shape on the card. So let me show you the card that I designed. Where is it here? Here it is. <laughs> so I have used crumb cake. Ooh. And I've got the beautiful petal pink blend that I have done with the old olive leaves and the beautiful nested framelits that I have cut out using that. And I've created my own note card. So I've just done... Oh. It's naked. It's doing a nudie run. Ready? Nudie run! <laughs> <laughs> so we are very excited about this. And I'm going to make this with you today to show you how easy and quick it is to make these beautiful note cards. So even when you finish all of the note cards from the Shelly kit, you could create your own little note cards because you're going to have a stamp set that comes with it. You're going to have some ink that comes with it. So it's great because it means that you can continue to make cards, especially if you have these beautiful nested framelit dies. Um, and if you have this stamp set, then you can keep creating with these beautiful colors that Shelly has shown us. You just need some paper. Yep, just need cardstock and you're you're off. And it's really exciting because, yeah, then you won't be afraid to use your kit too. <laughs> Nudie run. <laughs> So I will show you, uh, what was the other thing I was going to mention about this? Oh yes, so I've got two the more samples. I've got two more samples that I've made using Petal Pink and Old Olive and they're beautiful. So you're going to want to check my blog out tonight, Crafty Kylie. So no, you're alarmed. KylieBattucci.com, old habits die hard. Yes, <laughs> as soon as we finish this video, that that's what I'm working on next. <laughs> So let's do a little flippy flip here. Beth, Jessie's going over there. She's like, I'm going over that side. I have work to do. She's a busy girl. So let's have a look here. Now, the other thing that I have done is used the, because I know how much we love grunge, and this one is staying in the annual catalogue. If you want to get your hands on this one, you can get your hands on this now, straight away. But, oh, hello, Bruno. Did you have something you wanted to share? Oh, <laughs> we didn't know this. Oh, What's I'm going to be adding this. So, Bruno has just walked in. Hang on, I've got to move over this side because I'm not in the frame. So, Bruno's just walked in with a shock announcement. Does he have paper pumpkin? He has the stamp set that comes with the paper pumpkin. Oh, yeah, he got that at on stage. He got it at on stage. Because also... Oh! I am in shock. The reason why so I So we can use it. this beautiful grunge here because Shelly's got it. But if you don't have this stamp set yet, which majority of the world will not have this stamp set, but we do. <laughs> Jesse, that's the card here This well. is why it's my favourite because oh. I've seen it IRL. Oh, I love that we have all this. I love it. So this is like, this is what reminded me of the nested frames. And the other thing that I think is really cool is that we have the stamp set here. You could have made them already. I know. I'm going to make it with that. But, you know. No, we'll just... yours is cuter. I mean, I love this as well. But today, we'll, we'll, for this one that I'm making today, we'll use the, um, what should we use? We could use the grateful. Look how perfect it fits on there. Even the thank you or the hugs. or oh, hugs. So cute. So we'll have a look anyway. We'll have a play with this. But I'm totally going to use this little grungy bit for the background. Because I was going to use the gallery grunge. But forget that. We're using the paper pumpkin grunge. Check it. Yeah. We're going to use the one that comes in the kit. I know. Special much. It's like special news flash. Thanks for bringing that in, Bruno. So I have the card base here, which I've cut. Now, if you want to cut your own note cards, the note card size is 7 inches by 5 inches. So that is the card base. And then I just used a bit of crumb cake to do some background stamping. Oh, that hurt my ears. Sorry, Jessie. Yeah. Oh, and the other thing that we got a news flash on. So you've probably seen this beautiful textured gorgeous velvet ribbon love it oh it's so beautiful we've used a lot of this ribbon this is the rich raspberry 
But we've just found out recently in an update, it was like a special secret update that we got given that this exact ribbon is going to be in this the So Shelly kit or the um, hugs, hugs from Shelly Paper Pumpkin and it's going to be in Pretty Peacock. Ooh. I know, it's going to be so pretty. So that's, I'm very excited about that being in the kit. So we haven't seen it though. That's something we have not seen. But this one here is absolutely beautiful. This is the scalloped lace trim. Love it. So this is something you could color and put in the background with this beautiful, this whole set just goes so well with that beautiful lace. And then the other one that we've used quite a lot of is this beautiful petal pink ribbon. That's my ribbon. second roll. Yeah, second roll of organdy striped ribbon in the petal pink. So... There's a lot of beautiful additions that you can put on your card. So what we can do here is get our stamp. So I might use, I'm going to use this block here for my new grunge. I can't believe we've got the, the um, So Shelly stamp set here. I'm a shock. I'm a shocketed. So I'm going to grunge it all up because I love this sort of grunge look and you don't have to do the middle because we're going to be stamping that and you can sort of stamp off a little bit too just sort of use a bit of ink there but we want to do the leaves I really liked the leaves and the flowers as well so we can have this coming out the edge have it in different directions Yes, we use the same note card size everywhere in the world. So that one can stay. So I've done it the same size as what is in the catalogue and they're all the same size. So it's kind of a good size to do um, with customers because it doesn't matter where in the world, they're going to have the same size. No confusion with note cards, which is nice. Thanks for sharing, Carol. Oh, thank you. Enjoy your meeting. So that is going to be our beautiful design for the background. How beautiful is that grunge stamp set? Oh my goodness. I'm so excited by that stamp set. So that one can go. And okay. then I've already cut out my nested framelit because I know you're very busy people and you've got lots happening. And when I put it down, I can see I've got a little bit here missing that I want to fill with a, a pretty flower. So I'm just going to stamp that in there. And then we've got a beautiful background there that is ready to go. Now, I've decided to use the Free as a Bird stamp set. Now, this one here, that's actually what I was gonna say before. If you really, really want this stamp set now, then the best thing to do is to join our Stampin' Up! team. We've had five wonderful people join our team this Woohoo! month because they just wanna get their hands on the brand new products now. Same with the nested framelit dies. If you want to get your hands on them now, then and you can a lot add them. In there. Yeah, a lot. You can add them to your starter kit, and you will get sixty six dollars of product for free if you join. Use the joining option, and you can add anything you want to the starter kit, and then you get sixty six dollars of product for free. So it's a win win. And then once you join, you get 20% off all of your purchases. And if you have seen all these beautiful products that we're seeing, you know that it's worth doing. So just consider that because you can also add your hugs for Shelly in. You can also add in the beautiful Everything is Rosy. So there's a lot of awesome stuff you can do. That rosy is beautiful. It is very beautiful. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So... We're, we're almost finished the tutorial. That's going to be our big job to do tomorrow and the next day so that hopefully by the end of this week we can get that tutorial out to all those wonderful people that have pre-purchased our Everything is Rosie bundle. I'm very sorry, Jessie. Oh, is that bumping? I'm getting all wobbly. I'm very sorry. That's all right. They'll just going, they'll all be like, I'm getting vertigo. Vertigo? Yeah. Not vertigo. <laughs> vertigo. <laughs> I'll just sit and watch you. <laughs> You can probably glue inserts. But then I'll be going... Oh, that's you. true. That's true. I did promise I would take 10 minutes, didn't I? You did, and how long Stick did your head in, go. And how long do we go? You can't see your head. Oh. Oh. <laughs> She's like, oh. That was my bad angle. My bad angle. You don't have a bad angle, Jessie. You can be my stalker in the background. 
they're my hype girl. So I'm doing I'm doing this in early espresso, in case you're wondering what the colour is. And then just, it is actually easier, of course, to stamp and then cut. But for the sake of time, I did chop first, cut later. No, cut first, stamp later. <laughs> what even am I saying? Oh, Ooh. so pretty. It's a little bit on an angle, but that's okay. Well, but it, the branch is on an angle. Yeah, the birds are just sitting there very happily. And hopefully we have enough room for one of these. Let's have a look here. Oh, yeah, there's plenty here to choose from. Can hugs fit in? I don't want it to chop off the, the head, though. Oh, yeah, hugs. Hugs might fit. I should have gone a little bit lower. Thank you, won't fit. Flip it. I think dear friend. Oh, but if I flip it, it won't be as pretty. Oh, it's still pretty. Yeah, let's flip it. Good idea, Jessie. I'll listen to you, Jessie. Did I do soft suede? Oh, no, I did crumb cake. Oh, I don't want crumb cake for the birds anyway. So it's a good thing we flipped. I want early espresso because I want these birdies to pop. What are you doing? I'm winning. Are you winning? Yeah, because you used my suggestion. Yeah, I've listened to you, Jessie. Your suggestions are amazing and they have been validated. Ready? We're driving Bruno nuts today because I've been doing a lot of psychology. <clears throat> oh, it's always time for drinkies. Really? Look at it. Drinkies? Did someone say drinkies? <laughs> Deb, Deb. said that. It must be time for drinkies, Jessie. Deb, see, you know me so well. Seems you can't do any work. <laughs> <laughs> My hands are tired. My hands are tired, so I need to drink. <laughs> So now, oh, now we've got a lot more options. Uh -huh. Amy said, say hi to Bruno Velum. <laughs> Bruno Velum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, even Grateful so pretty. I just, there's so many options. I think Dear Friend. I like Dear Friend. I do too. I think that's really sweet. Let's do Dear Friend. But seriously, all of them would look amazing. You could do any of the above and then they would be loving it. Chopping it. Chopping it. I hope you're in my love it, chop it group. Dear friend, and because it's amazing photopolymer, which Kylie loves, I can I can see exactly where I'm stamping. So I could go, I think, around there. Do it. Do it. Commit and just do it. Just stamp. Oh, that is so beautiful. So we're going to love this stamp set that comes in this, really. It's so good. We're going to use it. If not, Free as a Bird is beautiful too. Yep, Free as a Bird is another one you can use. So then I brought in my beautiful blends. Here they are. Oh, look at that colour palette. I know, it's so beautiful. Thanks, Shelley. We love your, your colour ideas. Thank you, Gaynor. I've got hair attached there. So I started with the light. I do like to start with light on my blending. And because I've used a watercolour base, the early espresso, I was explaining this to Jessie today, it means that it's not going to blend out. In fact, it's actually better to start with dark. What am I even saying? Because then you can blend with the light. Ignore everything I just said. But really, I did. You'll see. <laughs> did you just ignore what I said? Yeah, I wasn't listening. <laughs> <laughs> good. But you said ignore what I pretend. Said, like, yeah, good. Start. Girl. Start again. Let's pretend Kylie said nothing. But as you can see, it really doesn't. Like you cannot go wrong with blends. You really can't. And I am not a colorer. I do not color. A color colorinera. A colorist. A colorist is a hairstylist, though, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm really, I'm not, I haven't been confident with colouring in the past. So if you're someone that's not confident or you think, oh, blends look intimidating, they're too scary, L literally, if I can do it, you totes can do it. No, I need the light. Oh, it's already on. Because it's, yeah. Oh, but it's, it's flashing. Uh -huh. It's still shadowy, yeah. I know. It, I one day, know. one day we'll work out a way to not have shadows. One day... So that's all I did for that. Now, I felt like it was a little bit, see how, liney. see what I mean? It was liney. Mm. So all I did was bring in my colour lifter. 
So I'll bring it up to show you. See what I mean here? See how it's like, you can see the edge of it a bit. So what I did was... Not natural. It doesn't look like it's naturally flowing. Ombre. It's not flowing. So you come in with your colour lifter. And it looks a bit weird when you first do it. It's like, what is happening? But it does take away a bit of that colour. Like magic. Yeah. And then it just sort of, just nicely blends. So your blends are your friend. Do not be afraid of blends. Is there anyone that's afraid? Yes, that is very true. And free as a bird isn't even out. But if you want it now, then you can join. Join and add it to your starter kit because demonstrators are able to pre-order it, which means you can add it to a starter kit. So We all have blonde moments, Amy. <laughs> what did Amy say? Oops, I forgot as I was thinking of another bird stamps. Set. Ah. My blonde. Lol. Oh, that's all right. But we won't say that because blondes are beautiful too. You're blondes, thinking of best Blondes birds. are wonderful and we're just, sometimes we're just imperfect. It's like when Jessie says, oh, you idiot. And I go, oh, no, you are not. Because I have blonde friends and they are beautiful people. No offence to any blondes. There we go. Look at this. So I'm just literally coming in, just tapping away with a little bit of the darker colour. <laughs> You've got some blends as a gift but haven't had it a go. Yeah, so um, you don't like using the blends at all, Anne. Oh, it's just practice. I, I was really, really afraid of the blends at first. But they are just like, you see this, I am just sort of coming in, blah, blah, blah. You've got to start with a kit. They're really good. Yeah. If you do something like this, and now even with the little beak, I can put that in there. Hi, Bruno. Hi. Are you making fun of me? Yeah. No. Just, just... Was he rolling eyes? No, I wasn't. Oh, that's good. You would know if I was rolling my eyes. <laughs> You would hear it. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be like, I just rolled my eyes out loud. <laughs> yeah, you've just got to have a little play because honestly, this is just so beautiful. And you can see how quickly and easily I've been able to colour in that beautiful stamp. And how fun was that? Yeah, you just got to start using them. Don't be afraid. Do not be scared. Now, all we're going to do now is just stick that down with some dimensionals. Do you know where the dimensionals have gone, lovely Jessie? I think yes. that might be them over there. Guten Tag, Tanya. Guten Tag. So we'll flip that over. And that oh, literally... Oh, Wendy. I was so confused. Yep. Poor Wendy. She had a secure, like her Facebook shut down. Oh, that's so annoying. So annoying. Look at me, I'm like doing a Bruno. <laughs> it's not going anywhere. <laughs> it's going to stay. What colour blend did I use first? Oh, so all the colours I always like to do, and I said my light first, but I actually do like to use the dark first, and then you can blend with the light, and it's the petal pink. Petal pink. That I used. Yep, they're all off. Good. And then we'll stick that down just there. Look how beautiful that is. Then I've got crumb cake, the light and the dark for the stem. And the leaves are old olive. So I've done the light to start with, and then just came out, came in with a little bit of the dark just to create some texture. And that is my beautiful little note card that I've done, inspired by Shelley. And you've got the one there that you can use with, if you don't have the paper pumpkin stamp yeah, set yet. I don't think you're far off. Oh, it's pretty good, isn't it? It's a pretty good replica. And the interesting thing with Shelley's cards is they are already pre-printed. So the only stamping that you're going to be doing is the sentiment. So this is a perfect... Uh, kit for someone who is crafting in a hurry um, don't have much time you want to give someone something but you, you don't have something made and all you'd be you're going to be doing is the sentiment because all the rest of it is done 
But if you wanted to challenge yourself a little bit and sort of step up your stamping, do a little bit more stamping of your own, then this is a great way to utilize your beautiful hugs with Shelly kit and sort of extend the life of your kit. Keep it going a bit longer and get more fun out of it. So even if you do get the kit, then the possibilities open up to a lot more than just the kit. You can see here that there's a lot more ideas that we can get from it. And all you did oh, was you wish you had Stampin' Up! in South Africa. Oh. I wish you did too. Hopefully one day. Jennifer, you'll just need to buy it from here. <laughs> we can't, sadly. We can't oh, sell no. to Jennifer. We can only sell on Australia. Yeah. So you will see the cards that are coming, but I'll give a little bit of a sneak peek. Oh! Oh, so come over to KylieBatucci.com. Boom. Oh, oh. Come and have a look because I have two other ideas. That's a really nice idea, Amy, if you're in, in hospital or if you know someone in hospital that needs a little bit of cheering up. Paper pumpkin kits are the best. Travelling. But this is so nice to know that you can extend the life of your kit as well. And you just cut the paper in half, didn't you? Or... Well, it's no. you can get two note cards out of the A4 cardstock, but it is the measurement is the seven inches by five inches to get the note cards. And I will definitely use my uh, note card kit, the Very Vanilla. We were very sad because I wanted to use the Very Vanilla, but we didn't have any Very Vanilla note cards. So that is another option, just to purchase some of the Very Vanilla note cards and then you're off. But I do like them being in the coloured bases because that's similar to the Paper Pumpkin kit. So I hope you enjoyed our little tutorial today, little quick video to show you that Paper Pumpkin is awesome. And that you need it now. And if you live in Australia and you have never done stamping before, this is the kit for you. Because it's nice what? and simple. You've ordered through one for your mum. Just going through breast cancer. That's so sad, Lisa. So good. This, I honestly think things like this, being able to craft and being able to give something like this to your mum will be just the best medicine for her. How wonderful to do something that takes your mind off that awful thing that she's going through mm. and also to yeah really help her to feel better she and might be able to give it to people, someone yeah if people bring her meals she might mm. want to say thank you that way mm. it, mm. it's very special mm. we love creating it makes us feel very happy and mm. even coloring i love using my blends it makes it makes you feel really happy and calm and they've done a lot of research on craft and it's very very good for you it helps with health so i wish that 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 stampin up would bring back craft note cards too let's all sandbox that bring back craft note cards we love them they're so beautiful oh tanya we used which dsp or stamp a bird set stamp set mm -hmm. with that one because this one doesn't come with it i think that that is a beautiful coordinating set and the fact that the paper pumpkin has the nesting framelit dies and oops hello stuck out there but if you hold up your stamp set jesse so this one here and this one here is a bundle they go together so it's almost like the paper pumpkin is based on this suite this bundle and that will be found on page 90 to 92 of the new annual catalog so to me it yeah very much came from this this suite had a lot of inspiration for Shelly as well. very Shelly. Very Shelly. Very Shelly. Yeah. Strangely it helped. Yes, made the first sympathy card. I agree, Katrina. I made a sympathy card for my friend, Melanie, the twins' mum. Her grandfather died and I did it for the whole family. And it's so good to do. It really helps with healing and so special for the family. They know that you've been thinking of them, so... Yeah, these kits are perfect for people who uh, are going through a tough time, for people who are in a hurry. There's just so many good things that come from cr creating. Yes, we are wearing the same lippy. Are we wearing the same lippy? Mm -hmm. Did you use mine? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're so naughty. We're like... <laughs> <laughs> Last week it was my lippy. <laughs> Hi, Dad. My dad's here. Frank. <laughs> He was very confused. He thought, who is who is on the screen? 
<laughs> in Hayman Island. Yeah, my brother's working on Hayman Island. Ooh. I know. He's working hard though. You adore the fat birds. Yeah, they're so cute. Aren't they gorgeous? <laughs> So, Susanna, you don't know Jessie. Everyone needs to know Jessie. This is this is Jessie, my amazing assistant. Number one. Number one assistant in the world. Yeah. I've been to all the conventions. On, on my badge. <laughs> I wear a pin with Jessie's face on it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that breaks my heart, Katrina. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. That's, That's awful. awful. Especially when it's a baby. Mm. That's just so difficult. Mm. Yes, and please big hugs to your mum, Lisa. Send our love to her because it's a tough thing to go through. Mm. We've got a few customers. Um, there's one particular customer. She just joined this week, Pam. And she's so cute. She goes, I went to see my husband in hospital and he's dying of cancer. And he's like, what are you up to? You've got like a bit of a sparkle in your eye. And she's like, Nothing. That she was joining. She was being so cheeky. But, yeah, he's. I think he's a bit worried about what's going to happen when he goes. And mm. But this is really mm. nice for her. Like I said, it's great. You get a community of people around you that can support you through that tough time. And it's very special. Yes, that's what Jesse wants to know. I want to go on all these <laughs> trips. Alison? So, Alison, this was our theory. They're too expensive. And Bruno would cry. Yeah. <laughs> he would He would not, the not first go. One, the first one, he was like, I'll go. He's like, oh, I'll go with you. Go. Come on. You can come with me, Jesse. And then he's like, I I'm coming. I'm not not coming. So instead, we went on a cruise together. Yeah, it was good. We went on a cruise at the what, beginning of last year. Yeah. And it was a lot of fun. So we took one of um, Jesse's friends from Adelaide mm -hmm. and we just played games and drank cocktails the whole the <laughs> whole much. 10 days. It was the best. <laughs> and eight, of course. But the funnest bit about being on that cruise was forcing Jesse not to use the lift. I made her use the stairs. It was so much fun. <laughs> Except when I got busted using the lift. <laughs> that was the best. There was people in the lift and I went, what do you think you're doing? And the people in the lift were like, I was hiding <laughs> in the corner, like, trying to, like... So I'm like, you, you get out here. You're using the lift. I think the I stairs. was... I'm using the stairs. I think I was fair because if it was after eight, then we were allowed to use the lift. And then we had to do the game, pick, pick a, a lift. lift. There was four lifts. We have to pick a lift. Who was going to... And then not long after that, we saw that it was an actual game on the cruise. Yeah, on my pick last lift. cruise. No, it was called uh, Lift Roulette. <laughs> <laughs> I think pick a lift is much pick a lift better. Is so much better. And we used to scare everyone with <laughs> the scream. <laughs> and they're all like, "What is happening here?" <laughs> but it was a lot of fun. We had a lot of time. And the other thing that I said, Alison, that wouldn't be fair to take Jesse on one of the trips is that then I have cool people like you and all these people that we want to catch up with, and then I don't get to spend time with Jesse. I want quality time when I go away with Jesse. So <laughs> we got to actually do people watching and we got to name all the different people on the cruise ship. We had my mum. My mum was on the Gail cruise ship. Was yeah, there. We were like, there's Gail. <laughs> <laughs> she was like dancing up a storm. Jesse even had a dance with her. Yeah. And I think she kissed you on, on the neck. Yeah, it was on the neck. She was, was, pre so she was pretty drunk. <laughs> and I was like, Gail, you're fabulous. She, she called her Gail. Oh, thanks. <laughs> and even though her name wasn't Gail, we just called her Gail. And then who else was there? There was the um, mullet man. No. Oh, your grumpy cat. There was one lady that was sad all the time. So we called her grumpy cat because she was always sad. And then who else was there? Mullet man. No, bra girl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so many, so many. Oh, so good. It's so good. <laughs> yeah, Bruno would very much complain. <laughs> Look at that. Sue's so like, how did you get the kit so quickly? <laughs> It's actually not the kit. We made our own. We made our own. Yeah. And we won. And we actually scored the stamp set from on stage. Yeah. So that was from on stage. So we got one sample. We don't know what the other three are. So we're just, you know, coming up with our own idea. Mm. Well, if they're going to hold it back from us, we'll I make know. our own. We're busting to see the other cards. <laughs> well, we've got our own little idea here of what it could look like. It'll be very interesting. 
That would be very interesting. Similar to you. I know, that would be very interesting. My goodness. We shall see. We'll see if our minds are thinking the same as Shelley. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, we love you all very much. Thanks for being here. I better let us get back to work because we're having a bit too much fun, aren't we? Yeah. I've got cards to make. And we have to make time to play Exploding Kittens. Ooh. And we've got a new game. What's the bear one? Bears versus babies. Bears versus babies. We're going to play that game too. That's all we did when we cruised. We just played all those new card games. It's so much fun. <laughs> so have a wonderful day, wonderful evening. I hope you get to do some creating soon. And we will be back here for our official Facebook Live on Friday. So check that out. But I'm sure you will see us somewhere, surprising you somewhere on Instagram or... Popping up. Yeah, we'll we just are. pop up. Oh! There they are again. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we'll sh we shall speak to you soon. And happy shopping. Enjoy getting your... Everyone get the paper yeah, pumpkin. Enjoy getting paper pumpkin. We do not know how long this will last. Remember Shelley said, mm -hmm. while supplies last and looking at this, crazy. Seriously. You don't want to have FOMO. Don't wait for this one because it's going really quick. Yeah. What's FOMO again, Jesse? Fear of missing out. Don't have a fear of missing out. Because then it'll be on eBay for $100. And you'll, want it and you'll pay that much. <laughs> then you'll be stuck paying $100 instead of $37. <laughs> Have a good time. Bye. Bye, everyone. Thanks for being here.